Chicken finger with comeback sauce. Hello everyone, this is David Hoffman of David's Been Here in Jackson, Mississippi, the city with soul. Today I'm gonna to take you around the Fondren neighborhood. We're gonna go see some guitars, then we're going to the Barrel House for drinks. We're gonna to go to Fondren after five, which is like a block party. <laughs> which is like a block party where there's music, there's drinks, there's food. Let's go first to Fondren Guitars. How you doing? Good, how are you? Very What's up, good. man? Yeah, I'm Patrick Harkins, and I'm the owner of Fondren Guitars. I opened up this store in 2006. And so we're going on almost 12 years of being open. And uh, we buy guitars, sell guitars, we teach guitars. And so um, it's just a cool spot where a lot of local musicians come in and hang out with us. And we have a lot of students that we teach and then we put them out in the music community and, and they uh, start bands. And so it's, it's really been cool over the last 10 years that I've been open to see how we've played a part in the scene around here in Mississippi music. Perfect, so what are we gonna do? We're gonna learn how to play guitar? Let's do it, yeah. Let's do it. show you how to play. Show you some blues. You know what you're doing, all right. Up here is the, hit, this big string is your E string. Hit it. All right. Now take your first finger, stick it right here on the second string down. Yeah, that's okay. it. Now put it on the second fret, which is the right. This one? Yeah, yeah, right there. Push that down and hit these two strings together. I'll hit both. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. What we're gonna do is we're gonna do a blues shuffle, and the way we're gonna do it is this. play guitar. Well, there's a few strings for a second there. Gotta thank Patrick for teaching me. And next up, we're going to the Barrel House. There we're gonna get a few drinks, probably eat some food, and keep exploring Fondren. This place has the best restaurants in the city. My name is Andrew Kehoe. I am owner GM, and we have been open for a little over a year. February 23rd, 2017 was when we opened and we're a uh, southern gastro pub we try to bring in uh where we focus on uh southern cuisine we're new american have a little uh, cajun influence little asian a uh, little italian it's a, an eclectic pub menu that uh, chef steven krueger did a great job with um, we have a a nice cocktail list with about 11 or 12 cocktails we have 12 drafts and we use and have a bunch of uh, Mississippi breweries. We try to keep as much as we can local. Um, we got a great bourbon list. We usually have around 35 to 40 bourbons at a time. And uh, when we got the space, it was it had been vacant for a while, and the, the interior had been covered. The barrel house and steel trusses were covered by a four-inch drop-down plaster ceiling. We busted that out, barrel rolled ceiling. That helped create the concept and name and then wine, bourbon, beer, barrel, everything and uh, here we are. Our food signature is our tuna poke nachos and then you're gonna try the Cades Alley which is our version of an old fashioned which is turned into our signature cocktail. Delicious bourbon. Yeah. That's, that's what I taste, it's like very citrus. very citrus. And also you smell it there, you know. This is a tuna poke nachos Fried wontons, you got uh, spicy aioli, avocado, what else? Uh, so we're coming, which is a sa seaweed salad. And uh, yeah, man, it looks bomb. <laughs> yeah. Let me see, well this one is nice, it has everything in it. Mmm. Oh wow. 
I love how he puts so many sesame seeds, you really taste the difference. Mmm, this is great. The seaweed salad with the tuna, perfect combination. You have the spicy, uh, uh, spicy avioli, and the avocado gives it a nice, like, cold flavor. Mmm. Right here we have an Imperial IPA from Southern Prohibition. This brewery is located in Hattiesburg, Mississippi. It's a very strong IPA, 8%, but not too hoppy. It's really good. Strong. That tuna poke nacho was so good. Cocktail was really strong. Definitely recommend it, but it's a little strong. But the beer, the beer from Mississippi is delicious. I've been just having a lot of IPAs. Next up, we're going to Babalu. I'm Justin Corson. Uh, this is Babalu Tapas and Tacos. We are a Cuban, Spanish, Hispanic, and Southern cuisine, all kind of infused into one. Uh, Babalu uh, style dining is a shared experience, so our culture is all about sharing. We like for you to uh, order several dishes of different kinds and everybody just kind of shares and uh, smaller portions that they kind of set up for that so um, you know we're really we're, we're sitting right in the heart of Jackson in our Fonder neighborhood that we're super proud of there's lots of great businesses and restaurants and it's just a great local area very community based and uh, uh, we're really excited just about about the culture that we have here at Babalu. Uh, today we'll have the uh, Baba Burger and our famous tableside guacamole. And a beer? What beers you guys got? Man, we've got all kind of beers, uh, but we do have some local beers as well. Our Lucky Town Brewery, which is a couple of blocks away from us here, uh, has our pub ale, which is, is, a, is a big seller here. So here at Babalu, you can sit inside, outside, at the bar. I'm sitting outside. It's very beautiful right now. Great weather. I'm having Ghost River Red Ale. Delicious beer from Memphis. Got the guac right here. They made it a little differently but it still looks great. Mm. Oh wow, some delicious guacamole. The Baba Burger, best burger in town, best burger in Jackson, four out of the past five years. Applewood smoked bacon, pies avocados, caramelized onions, roasted Roma tomatoes, a chipotle aioli and white cheddar cheese, six ounces of uh, beef there on a sweet sourdough bun. This is the last thing I'm eating today. Oh my god, the caramelized onion with the bacon. I don't know if they have comeback sauce in here, or this is an alioli. Oh man. Alright guys, my last bite. This burger is delicious. They also have a tomato in there, and it popped in my mouth. So that's Babalu. Great place to come for dinner. And next up, I'm going to Fondren After Five. Fondren After Five is basically a block party every first Thursday of the month. Today is actually the first one of the year because they postponed it in winter and just opened right now for April. It's basically local businesses that have, you know, restaurants or whatever. They have like little uh, spots where they'll either sell food, beers, place for kids. It's a, it's a block party. So we're gonna go there, probably have a beer, have another bite. All right, I'm Jim Wilkerson, Executive Director of Fondren Renaissance Foundation. And today you're in Fondren. Right now we're having Fondren After Five, which is our first Thursday monthly event where we the big open house. Everybody comes in the streets, see your neighbors, meet new friends, and uh, gather with old. So all of our restaurants stay open late. Our shops are open late. We have a lot of gallery openings. And uh, so everybody just kind of comes together in one big spirit to open up the community. Fondren's a great revitalized area that's been hip and happy for the last 10 years we're still headed to more directions taking Jackson to that new height but it's an awesome place of diversity um, everyone is welcome here and we just have a really cool collections of boutiques and uh, small restaurants um, for everyone to experience and it's just a great little taste of the south right in the middle of the capital city of Jackson coming up we've got uh, two hotels right now that have already broken ground uh, in summer of 19 they should be ready for you to come and inhabit and then we have another one that'll be using some architectural tax historical credits that will be coming up out of the old cleaners and so that'll become another boutique hotel too so a lot of cool things on the horizon and uh, we want to see you in Fondren. So this is Fondren after five it's a block party every first Thursday of the month starting in March this year started in April, so this is the first one of the year. It goes all the way to December. There's live music, there's food, well, a little bit of food, and there's a lot of beer. <laughs> the strawberry lager is seasonal for Avita in New Orleans. What do you guys, you guys are distracting me. Strawberry lager is good though. 
I hope you liked Fondren after five. It was awesome. Block party, lots of cool people, met a lot of Mississippians. These people are so nice. I gotta thank all my friends in Mississippi, in Jackson, Mississippi, for treating me amazing. You guys have been awesome. We're back in downtown Jackson. I just left my car at the hotel. I'm walking like three blocks to Underground 119. We're gonna hear some live blues. We're gonna eat some food and we're gonna drink some beer. Let's go to Underground 119. I hear they have some of the best blues in downtown. And this is the last night, so I gotta enjoy it. Blues all day. Underground 119. Love it. It's like under a little townhome. Hey, welcome to Underground 119. My name is Jane Jones. I'm the general manager here. 119 was open for quite a few years. It closed for about a year and a half. We've been reopened for a year now. Uh, we're open Thursday, Friday, and Saturday nights. We have live blues every night that we're open. Um, so yeah, this is a little uh, blues joint, little juke joint here in uh, Jackson, Mississippi. In downtown. Jane, what's Comeback Sauce? Uh, comeback Sauce is, um, well, invented here in the Jackson area of Mississippi. Um, it's kind of base is uh, mayonnaise, garlic, and then you put your fun stuff and your own twist in it. Um, it's so good, it makes you want to come back. They're all so different. Mm. Nice with the cracker. All right, we got some fried green beans with Comeback Sauce. Stuff. Oh, it's still hot. It's still really yeah, hot. <laughs> Oh wow. Mm. We sell a lot of that when people just want a little nibble with their with their drinks. <laughs> they say you're gonna bring a little bit. <laughs> uh, <and laughs> that wasn't a little bit. That is a little bit. Like half a handful. Nice. It kind of fills up the basket. Oh my god. Yeah. Spicy fried green beans. Spicy fried green beans. I got some tang to it. Mm. So good. They are good. <laughs> What do we have here, fried chicken? Yes, it's just, uh, I mean, our simple fried chicken. We, we bread and batter and fry it. It's just really good with the... Uh, it's with hot. The chicken finger with comeback sauce. Or too hot. Oh, it was amazing. It was... It was hot. And then here, Underground 119, it's been an incredible day. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Everybody who watches this video needs to leave me a comment below. Thanks guys, I'll see you tomorrow in Jackson, Mississippi on another adventure. This city was so...